Guys, Hydrophobic Guy here. Today I'm going to be testing Always Dry on denim jeans, a t-shirt, and stones. So we have Always Dry here, a product from Belgium. And what I like about Always Dry is that it doesn't leave a hazy, disgusting finish like Neverwet does. As you can see, they look like normal jeans and a normal t-shirt. And this product is mainly used for textiles and uh, wood. I'm going to go ahead and test the jeans first and then I'll go do the t-shirt. As you can see it beads right up and normally if you were just put water on jeans it would soak right in and I was pretty much surprised with this product. It's really, it's really cool. Um, thanks to the guys for Always Dry for opening my eyes to a cool product. And to get it off, you kind of just uh, tap it, so you just shake it off. And you kind of brush off the rest, and completely dry. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and do the t-shirt now. Just kind of dissipates and beads right up. It's very cool. It's pretty impact resistant, unlike Never Wet. Mm. All right, this should be good enough for y'all. Um, and to get it off, you just shake it off, just like the jeans. Just gonna go ahead and lift it up. And good as new. All right, as you can see, the Always Dry is a very good product for clothing. Um, I'll put a link in the video that shows how much it is. And it's around $30, $35. And you get a bottle like this. And it lasts for a pretty long time. Uh, as you can see, I sp sprayed the entire t-shirt and the shoes and the wood in the previous video, as well as the stones. All right, so next up we're gonna have the stones. All right, here's the stone. So try to guess which side is coated with um, always dry and what's not. So there we go. It's kind of easy to tell, isn't it? The left side is coated with, I mean the right side is coated with always dry and the left side is just normal non-coated brick. I also have a white brick to compare the colors. On the red brick, it actually adds color to the brick and it doesn't look as dull. Alright, so let's go ahead and do the white brick. I'll just go ahead and pour it on here. That's really cool. Just kind of comes right off. And then over here, just gets wet from the water. So I'm going to go across both layers, both sides I mean, also in here. As you can see there's a clear distinct line where the always dry stops and that'll be right here and right there. Also, Always Dry is just a one spray application, unlike Never Wet, where you have to spray a base layer and then a, uh, a top layer. And after, overall, I think this is pretty cool stuff, as you can see by the demonstration here. And to take it off, you just shake it off. And then this one, too. Very cool stuff. Alright, thanks for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe. Um, and thanks again from the guys from Always Dry. I'll be doing more videos soon. Stay tuned.